I love it very much. I think it's time to spill a little tea, as the kids on the internet say, and I don't mind doing this because Travis Scott is genuinely a horrible person. So in 2009, when I met Travis Scott, I was running a site called EarMilk.com with my friends Trey and Blake. Uh, and I was a junior level software engineer and I had just finished working for MySpace Music. So I worked in the technology side of music. For Travis, what we did was fake his popularity. I programmed a fleet of SoundCloud bots to artificially inflate his play counts on SoundCloud. This told record label executives that he was much more popular than he actually was. We also did the same thing early on with Twitter. You may have noticed, and somebody made a joke about it, that his early followers could make an omelet because they were all eggs. Uh, we used software to enhance his visibility uh, via... Um, the wrong means. <laughs> real rapper shit. Real rapper shit. Um, real rapper. The real rapper. What up, though? It's your boy Rozzy, and we're here on another episode of Real Rapper Shit. Um, this is an interesting one for me, man. In the middle of everybody talking about Travis Scott, this is a situation where we're talking about him inflating his numbers. If you see, this was his past manager, and they said they inflated his numbers in order for the labels to come and sign him. Man, me being an artist myself, those who know me know that I didn't just start doing real rapper shit without being a real rapper. I am a real rapper. I got projects out. It's crazy because I've been in label situations and I've been there and they literally passed up on deals and situations out of numbers. Talking about you had to have a certain amount of numbers, which is the crazy situation because before I even knew that, I always felt like it was something tricky about that because numbers can be manipulated. And when I thought I was wrong, just when I thought that maybe they right and I don't know what I'm talking about, the truth comes out. So Travis Scott actually had his numbers manipulated before he even got to sign to a situation. Now, am I mad at Travis? Hell no. Nah. I ain't mad at nobody who manipulated their numbers to get over on the system so they can get that bag as long as that music is good. But my whole thing is we're trying to get to a point where people are more consistent on real music and off real feelings before pre-social media, pre-numbers that don't even exist and not even real type of situations about real life music and what's good and what's not. So now that we know it's not just a, a, a pre thing anymore. We're not we're not just seeing, oh, maybe it's about these numbers or maybe these numbers are fabricated. Now that we know this for a fact, please take that into account before you scroll past somebody's music or you say, oh, well, I'm not listening to that because there's not enough views on there. Those views can be bought. Those views have been bought. Those views will be bought. If you like somebody's music, like their music before what it is. And I feel like Travis makes great music. He probably was making great music back then. He's making great music now. But in order for him to hit that next level and for him to be elevated, they had to play the game of the, the numbers game and, and all that, man. Long story short, if y'all like somebody's music, like that music for what it is. And if it has, if it takes somebody else saying, oh, I like this music in order for you to say you like that music, maybe you don't really like that music. Think about it. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, man. This is coming from a real rapper in the middle of the game, currently still active. I'm not a fat boy in my basement just doing blogs. Shout out to academics. Like, comment, and subscribe. Real rapper shit. Real rapper shit. Real rapper shit. No, real rapper. The real rapper. Try to say I ain't no real rapper now. It's crazy to me because they thought we was gonna do real rapper shit. Real rapper shit. Real rapper shit. Real rapper, real rapper hey, shit. Man. Real rapper shit. Real rapper shit, man. That's when they thought we wasn't gonna do no real rapper shit. More real rapper shit. Man, I told y'all we was gonna do this real rapper shit. It's real rapper shit.